Alright, welcome back everyone to Banjo Tui Let's Play. This is part 15. And I forgot we already unlocked the next world, so all we have to do now is uh, gain access to it, so we'll be doing that right now. <laughs> anyway. Um if we bring Kazooie up. Yeah, here we go. Perfect. And we should have access to a very large area now. Isle of Hag's Cliff Top. Oh boy. This is not something I wanted to see. Wow, I really got nervous there. <laughs> anyway, um, we got a new new move here. A new a new move. Ice eggs. Ooh, freezing cold, but that's the price for laughing. Launching eggs, so solid a solid ice. Ice eggs. And a fantastic view of the cliff top that you could fall off of. Thank you for that. And that'll be all. We'll show then. Ice eggs. And there's a cliff ledge over here, so we might as well go explore it. Is there going to be an enemy? No. Alright. Oh, it looks like a train switch. Looks like a train switch. Opening the doors. The gates of hell. Not really. Um. So the train can come out to Isle of Hags. Huh. Alright. There's gotta be some use for that, I suppose. Alright, so. Now we've got. That unlocked. We got a mumbo pad, and. Oh, a very expansive area over here. You jerk. You're gonna come out? Yeah, I knew it. I knew it, you. You fur bag. <laughs> Alright. What do we got around here? We got Momo's skull. And. We've got Mumbo, who doesn't want anything to do with us unless we have a Globo. So, we'll go ahead and explore this area a little further. Um, this is a, this is an area we'll be back, coming back to a lot. Um, it has a level now, and then a level closer to the end of the game, so we'll be coming back here quite a bit. But for now, this portion we aren't going to be dealing with for a while. Long while, actually, but it's good to unlock it and explore its treasures. Um, actually, this is... Yeah, this should go all the way back. Yep. Um, I haven't unlocked, and I thought I did, but I haven't unlocked the next world, so we'll go ahead and do that, and to do that, we have to go into Master Jiggy Wiggy. So, with that in mind, we have 27 Jiggies, and he requires 14 of us. From us. Eh, it's all good wording-wise. Anyway, um, our third challenge is to put more puzzle pieces back than last time. So, we're going to do that. Right? That's not gonna go there. It's gonna go on the bottom right. No, top right. Oh, I love puzzles. That should not. No. You dummy. Put it. Oh my gosh. There you go. And. That should be. In that end. 
Oh boy. Puzzles are not my forte. <laughs> there we go. There's only a couple that could be, and it's the wrong one. And there we go. And boom. And boom. And you've completed Jiggy Wiggy's Challenge 4. So he's gonna show us the way. Ah, oh, Bob. I can't do a good Jiggy Wiggy impression. Sounds like a synthesized voice to me, but... Which is probably the case. Oh boy. Well, this is going to lead right over to the... Oh, there's a global. <laughs> okay, well noted for later. Anyway, this is going to our... the area we were at before. Which... a strike of lightning opens the door. So there. You are indeed the chosen one. You also have enough jiggies to attempt Jiggy Wiggy's Challenge 5. I might have, I probably won't have enough to do six as, t as well. So we'll go ahead and do this. Uh oh. Ooh, dinosaurs. Alright. Uh. No. No. It's in the corner. Oh my goodness. There you go. It goes somewhere. There we go. This is mine. Oh yeah, bottom one, alright. Alright, I see your game. And the easy ones are done. Now we have to figure out the hard ones. And it ain't up there. There we go. Another middle piece. That goes there. And boom. And every time I do this challenge, it seems I have less and less time left at the end. So, that's a sign of things to come for the later levels because they get less and less pieces initially placed. So, that will be a challenge. Alright. He's powering up his Jiggy Mobile, and he has shot it. Wasteland. Ooh, this is cool. Oh boy. There's a big rock. And boom. No. Boom. Okay. <laughs> Time is a little off, but we're good. Alright. Oh, I don't have enough. I think it's like one or two jiggies. Come back later when you do. Yeah, one jiggy. Blasphemy. Blasphemy, I say. Oh well. Two worlds is enough expansion for the moment. Plenty. So we'll go and uh, go back to the cliff top and enter the next world, which is going to be Jolly Rogers Lagoon. Oh yeah! All right, Jolly Rogers Lagoon. What awaits us in this wonderful world here? Oh, we got some breakable dirt here. Oh, what? what? This is a doubloon. They are the only currency accepted in the Jolly Rogers Lagoon. Interesting. But right now, rather useless. But it won't be useless here soon enough. 
currency will get to so get to get us all sorts of cool stuff. Nope. Got the balloon. Then we got some notes. Well, let's go in the first building here. Why not? Yeah, what is this? Pono's Emporium. Greetings, friend. The name is Pono. I'm a local pawnbroker. We're interested in that jiggy in the case. Oh, yes. Real nice piece. Circa Banjo Kazooie, so I was told. I reckon 20 gold doubloons would be a fair price. Wow. Yeah, 20 doubloons is zero. <laughs> yeah. 20 doubloons is, uh, pretty much. Well, I think you get closer to 30 in this world, but. It's a majority of them, that's for sure. Still 20 doubloons for the Jiggy. Would you like to buy it? What do you say? I or no? Well, if you change your mind, you know where I am. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh. Oh, cool. It's Brentilda. Grunty's, uh, nicer side. Nicer sister. Whatever you want to call it. She gave us hints to Grunty's personal life in the other game. So. Oh, we got full ice eggs, full grenade eggs. We're doing good there. So, we need to find 20 doubloons. And one of our, as one of our things here. One of our tasks. Um. Let's see what we got here. There. Oh! A jumpy pad. Oh, there's a crack in that structure. That means we can blow it up. Oh my gosh. Split pad. It is indeed a split pad. Now uh, let's go over. And I already found out that Banjo Kazooie together cannot get as high enough to get these. So Kazooie will have to do the job. And she does. So, with that, let's go over here and go into Jollies. <laughs> We're gonna go into Jollies. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, we got a menu today specials. A ginger beer. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Jolly Roger Town Mayor and Proprietor of this lovely Harborside Inn. We'd like a ginger beer, please. I'm not obliged, but my list. Jolly, at the moment, my partner's gone missing. How about that? <laughs> okay. So he's out on a weight race early yesterday evening. I heard a big golfing noise, and when I got outside, she was gone. She's eaten by a vicious sea demon. I hope not. She, um, uh, happy hour soon. I need help. We checked around room. It's half price at two balloons. Is this not, not anymore? Dug a hole in the corner of it. How about it? Aye. Aye. Okay, big balloon. Oh my gosh. This is a very, uh, alternate person you're speaking to, I would say. A little bit different. Cheers, but how can you possibly sleep when my partner is still missing? So I sleep very soundly, Jolly. It's very soundly. Oh, here's this naughty mole. Sub Aqua Aiming. When in the water and baddies attack, this new move will let you sh shoot back. Stop seeing for the aiming sight. Fall by Z to start a fight. Hmm. In the yawn. Dismiss. Okay. And we've got feathers in the closet there. We've got a lovely bed. And we've got a jukebox. The jukebox does something, by the way. Uh, it's really cool. When you get it working, that is. Um, what else we got around here? Uh, 
Uh oh, we're up close and personal. And pers yeah, we f could figure that out. <laughs> Alright, what's back here? Who is this? A boss there, you scurvy dogs. I be Captain Black Eye. Fearless pirate and scourge of the seas. Yeah, I don't know what's in that carbonated drink you got there. Just a touch of seasickness, you filthy rats. Pirate you are. <laughs> Watch your tongue, buzzard. Hmm. Shiver me timbers. This seasick tablets Jolly gave me are mighty useless. Splice the main brace. One more press of that but their button and now I'll run you through. You gotta keep pressing the button. Right, I'll slit you. Oh, me poor stomach. Just take these doubloons and fetch me another glass of water. Thank you. We still gotta keep talking to you. Me thinks. Yep. <laughs> yeah, alright. Fell fat, flat on your ass. Ah, we're in this fine game. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means, sir. You're mighty useless on the floor there. Ugh. Oh well. Jolly's is certainly full of characters. Probably one of the most memorable places in this game, I would say. For characters that I would remember right off the bat. Um, okay, we got a building down there. Looks like we've got a lagoon to explore over there, and we got Mumbo's bin. Oh, look at this, some doubloons. And we've got a go globo. Oh, there's a crack in the wall. <laughs> Who knew? And we have Mumbo sitting there. Let's see what's over here, I suppose. Because this is a... Uh, this is a very... This is different. That's for sure. We got another lagoon area. And there's a bad guy. And a turtle. Well, I don't know what to do. Tip top. Oh! From the previous game. This is 32 weeks late. Hmm. We're telling out a bird he's supposed to get out himself. Well, obviously, the missus is maybe not who you think she is. <laughs> Certain things might be going on that Tip Top's not aware of. Oh well. Um, well it looks like that's all in that area. Bit of a lagoon and, uh, Tip Top. For now, we're gonna go explore the other area. Um, and see what's around. Oh, let's see, we got a building here. We got some notes. Wave racers. Oh, Bubber's wave racer hire. Oh, wow. Hi there, it be you old shipmate, Captain Blubber. How you going, your heart is? <laughs> Adventures are all the same, so many places to go and things to find. Be standing around, though. Oh. Our shipwreck in the last one was eaten by a fish yesterday. Oh. I think I can lend you a doubloon or two. I will say you meet last possession for just one doubloon. How about it, me hearties? You want my last possession for one doubloon? Aye, sir. There you go. How are you good in banjo? Have a look inside this here crate. Thanks, shipmates. I'll be out to Jolly's for their quiz night. There'll be 1,000 doubloons up for grabs, and if I win, I'll be having a fine new flying machine. Oh my goodness. We just made his day. <laughs> Completely happy now. Oh, we got a sign here. Legend has it that a goldfish holds the secret to fast swimming. 
Oh, that's right. Wow. I think, uh... I think I get that sometime, but... I will... Yeah, I'll show that off. Um... I need to see if that's somewhere where I cut it off. <laughs> Not, uh... Yeah, it's not needed, but it sure helps. Fast swimming. Um, so, if, even if I don't have it, I'll show it off sometime. I know I got it, so I'm not going to worry about it. I'm good with not rushing. It seems to mess things up anyway. Oh, more doubloons. More doubloons for your hearties to grab. Uh oh, who's that? There's some moving things over here. Pigs? Looks like pigs. Oh boy. And we're up to 19, so I just need to find more pigs. That's fine to me. I wanted to go swimming, but the water is polluted and icy cold. <laughs> okay. Fine. What's your problem? Oh, you have, you, you have three arms. And look what's happened to my arm. <laughs> I didn't want to say anything. <laughs> I won't touch you about it as you might expect. Freako. <laughs> Oh, look at the swampy garbage that's coming into this pool. And it's draining into who knows where. This is not good. Pollution at its finest. <laughs> wow. Anyway, we've got 23. So, I could go over and get the jiggy. But since I'm not in control, I'm going to... See what's gonna happen. And uh, that will be a next part of our Banjo Tui Let's Play. So join me next time when we're gonna go in the Pono shop here and trade in our doubloons for a jiggy.